Hello, ladies and gentlemen, this is Terry. I am showing you a very interesting game called Unstoppable War. Uh, this game was made by Future Mark Game Studio. Uh, it was kind of introduced to me from my friend Nick on YouTube. I've been watching his Let's Play videos on Dark Souls, and he's one of the many Let's Play guys I've been watching play through games, and he tried out this game, and I watched him play it, and I said, hey, that game does look kind of fun. It's a tower defense type game, like League of Legends, except it's well, you'll just have to see for yourself. Oh no, it's my cat. You can hear my cat. We'll start at the beginning since. Okay. Let's see. Beyond the orbit of Neptune, the scientists of space-based Zulu discover Lowe's Planet X. One of the greatest questions of all time has been answered. Man is not alone in space. The world watches as telescopes reveal the strange cities of an advanced civilization. War hero Captain Adam and his fiancée Ariel, winner of the Miss Solar System pageant, travel to Planet X to greet our galactic neighbors. Celebration turns to panic as a vast armada of flying saucers is launched. Will Captain Adam arrive in time to save the scientists? Oh no. Ah, this is just a tutorial. Click here to skip tutorial. Okay, the first thing you need to do is put a generator out there so you can make some money so you can buy stuff like these turrets to help defend your base the key thing to do here is to wait and see if their path changes. Right now, the current path, my turret's gonna take care of these guys easily. And I'm saving up my money. I need to spend this. That's to do research so I can upgrade stuff. Now see they changed the path, so I need to build this turret here. Uh, Odin, you talk too much. My cat just doesn't stop. But yeah, he, he, he wants to do some comments. That's why he's talking. He's jealous because I'm on the camera. I mean, I'm on the mic, whatever. <laughs> well, with all the money that I've got, I might as well. Um, I guess I can. Later on, you're up here able to upgrade your turrets. Oh no, how did it get away from me? No, I didn't. I was close to them. Ooh, apparently I'm not going to too. Let's press on. Oh no. Oh no. Feels 
filthy earthling tower before the most exalted and glorious King Gorg of the Gorg. I have watched your disgusting species spreading from planet to planet like a revolting germ. There is a price to pay for your reckless abandon. I will eradicate your repulsive kind, starting with your queen, Ariel. There is no time to mourn as you race towards empty. The Gorg Omada breathing down your neck. Defend Space Base Bravo and show the Gorg you are not being a fight. Oops, I think I just skipped that cinematic. Ah, oh well, you'll just have to get the game and see it for yourself. I'm kidding, I'll play it. New York, the scene of an unprecedented newsreel record as President Culver addresses world leaders. Across the solar system, preparations are made to protect Earth from the relentless march of the Gorg. Liftoff as satellites are sent to defend mankind's outposts among the stars. President Culver tells reporters there can be only one response to the Gorg threat. It's war! <laughs> uh, I love these old-timey videos. They're so silly. I want that satellite, and that satellite, and that satellite, and that research. That means I can upgrade my turret in the next battle. Oops. Here they come. It takes a while for the money to build up, so you gotta make sure that you got enough. Enough to spend wise money. As in, that spot right there looks like a good spot for a turret. Because it, it not only attacks things on this side, but this guy is going to come through here, and that turret can take him out, too. So that's a good spot for a turret. It gets harder, though, believe me. It gets much harder. See, now that I upgraded that turret, it takes him out a lot. Oh, another thing I forgot to mention was that you can move these around. So that you can set your turrets up in a way that them out like that. It may look like I'm doing well, but I'm actually not because I haven't built a research station. Uh-oh. 
This is bad. This is really bad. Okay, yeah, I'm doing great now. We built two many makers so the map piles up quicker. And my research maxed out before the end. So yeah, I got all the medals. So yeah, that's about the case ever. I think you understand how it goes. And yeah, that's the game. You'll have to buy the game to find out more of the story, but you get the gist of it. Take care, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the show.